Hi you guys, I'm glad you made it back. Okay, today I wanted to show you how I cleaned my uh, product that I used. I typically use it on my car and my mag wheels are made out of aluminum. And I was shining them up one day and I remembered my, how my threshold looked. So I thought I'd try it. Check out how clean I got it. You can see this before and after shot here. The left side is the before shot and obviously the right side is the after shot. Let me show you how easy it is to clean and how good this product works. All you're gonna need is some steel wool, a wet rag, and a little bit of elbow grease. So let's get to work. Okay, all I'm using is this spray. It is an acid, so if you need to use some masking tape or put gloves on, it's up to you. Of course, read the directions in the back, the do's and don'ts. Okay, here we go. So I've got the door open. Uh, there is some fumes to this. They're not terribly bad, but you don't want to smell them. So all we're going to do now is just spray it on and leave it on there for about five minutes. Once you've sprayed it on and it's been there for five minutes, go ahead and take the steel wool and start scrubbing. If you need some more, go ahead and spray. It's up to you to wear gloves. I suggest you wear gloves, but I'm so used to this stuff, it doesn't bother me. There's no real secret, it's just putting some elbow grease with your steel wool and just use left and right motions. Try not to use circular motions, otherwise you're going to see scratches. So just go left to right. I'm just using regular steel wool, nothing special about it. Wow, you can already see the difference. You can see the area where I worked on and the area and the other area that I didn't. What a difference. By the way, I don't know if I told you, you can buy this product at any auto parts store or detail shop. This stuff really works really good. It breaks down the grime really easily because it's got a caustic solution. I can tell already just by using the steel wool that it's starting to look really, really shiny. Can't wait to put a wet rag on it and see what it looks like. Or acetone. And if you ladies don't have either of those products, try some nail polish remover. Now polish remover is a little longer, but eventually will take off paint. I'll just do that later. Wow, look how clean it's gotten. I can't believe it. I should have did this years ago. Like I said, there's some paint that I need to remove, but that'll be easy. Just a little putty knife and some lacquer thinner or acetone or nail polish remover. Anyway, it looks really great. I'm happy with it. Again, I'm happy that I shared this with you. Wow, what a big difference, huh? Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed making them. So can't wait to see you on my next video. Until then, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you later. Bye. <music>